Hello everybody, this is TT Lemon and what we have here is the new smallest design for a downward double extender. It has a volume of 15 blocks as opposed to the last smallest one which had a volume of 16 blocks. It's 5x3 which is really quite compact and it works on a pretty cool principle I got from a Minecraft with Dummies video which I'll link in the description which is where I got the steer for the block and the torch combo from here. Now if you want to build it just build what you see here and remember to put an item in that hopper. Now, to explain how this design works, I'm going to take away a few of the components. I mean, this torch and this torch here. So I can show you how it works, kind of slow down and add the components in as we go along to show you how they work. So as you can see at the moment, we're in the state where these are powered, this torch is powering that, and this is being bud powered by that because there's an item in this hopper which is being held in there by this torch which powering the block, powering the hopper, not letting any items go anywhere. So I'm going to pull the lever, these two torches are going to be the power which will lift this piston up and then the bud power from here, the diagonal power from here is going to be removed because this torch is going to turn off and this item is going to roll out of the hopper backwards like that. Now since this is turned off this torch will turn on you can see, because of the update order again, this is going to power this piston instead of this piston, and it's going to grab down for the block. And then, as this is off, the torch here is going to turn on, like that. And the item which was, was in here is going to be forced back into the hopper, because it's being powered. And it's also going to be kept in the hopper, because the hopper is being powered by the torch through the dropper. And that's just going to push the item back in, turn the comparator on, turn the torch off. Now this piston doesn't re-update and go down like that because this tor when this torch turns off this power has already been put on so this is a delay of one tick which basically means when it's coming up it won't re-update itself. Now you can see what happened if that didn't happen in Minecraft and what happens in Bucket at the moment which is why this won't work on Bucket servers this happens. You can see the piston updates itself again because there's no block on it. So if we just put that back, you'll see it works again. So if you have any questions about this, any queries, any things like you don't understand how parts of it work, which I haven't explained clearly enough for you, just ask that in the comments. And thank you for watching, and this has been TT Lemon.